So this peg's just come in for a damp repair. We've, we've isolated it to the top knuckles and a locker, which was leaking. So what we'll do is we'll, I'll show you the replacement floor. I have already stripped it, but I'll show you the replacement floor. Show you the build back up. Reseal the knuckles. Show you where I've resealed the toilet door. And uh, yeah, hopefully you've got an idea how it all works. And enjoy. Make sure that channel there is clear all the way down, all the way out. You don't want anything blocking it because if it does and the wall comes in and gets under that plastic trim, that's where you're going to get rot. Cut it away, keep the channel clear, no rot in that corner.
you want to take these two bolts out now these are the legs 13 mil deep socket take them nice and slow when you take them out otherwise you'll start spinning the bolt inside you'll have to get chisel around them and get some mole grips on them and stuff so just take your time wait till they come pull it down slightly when you get when they're hand hand loose and just spin them off Don't forget to axle stand under both sides, basically where the legs come off, where the little the hole, when you pull them off you'll see in a minute, where that hole is, just get them under there, nice and snug. I tend to wire the legs up and then wind them down onto the axle stands, then move the legs. Give everywhere a little hoover. Don't any bits there when you glue it down and stuff. I have already cut and measured the board. I've just cut it a little bit wider, about half an inch, quarter of an inch wider, and stepped it in slightly just by this little curve I'll show you in a minute. 